Hey everyone, I hate to say it, but it's looking like 2023 is gonna be another really hard year for businesses. Belts are being tightened, budgets are being cut, and we're seeing huge layoffs in the tech world. And the businesses that want to succeed in continuing to build their brand, attract new talent, and drive new sales are gonna have to work harder than ever to do so in this challenging and hyper-competitive environment. At 365, we create tons of different video content for a lot of different clients. So today, I wanted to share some of the different ways that brands can leverage video content in 2023 to continue to build and stand out in a tough business climate. So here are eight types of videos that your business should think about making in 2023. Number one is just a straight up project showcase. If you have a particular project or case study that you're especially proud of, you may wanna consider documenting that project in video format. Or if you have a big and exciting project coming up, you may wanna consider documenting that process and progress, whether that means hiring professionals or capturing it yourself on an iPhone. Number two, Lifestyle ads. One of the best ways to create a positive feeling and connection between your customer and your product is by creating content that's fun, exciting, and that people actually like, while incorporating your product into that experience in a subtle way. This video that we created for Nova Scotia Fisherman's Extreme Moisture Skincare product is an excellent example of this. Check out some of the comments from when they posted it on their Instagram. Number three, funny shit. We all love to laugh and a little bit of humility goes a long way in building trust. Our friends at Cottage Springs and the Ace Beverage Group have done a great job of leveraging humor to keep their audience engaged and entertained and we've had a blast working with them. Bobby Margarita, signing off. Number four, motion graphics and animated videos. In some cases, like an explainer video or a tech product video, motion graphics and or animation can be super helpful in breaking down complex concepts, products or services into simple, beautiful and consumable content that potential customers can watch and understand immediately. You can create a video that's 100% motion graphics like this one, or you can supplement live action video content with motion graphics layered on top for added effect. A common use would be displaying statistics or displaying the UI of a product that a subject on screen might be using. Number five, just general update videos. We're all very familiar with the ways that brands and businesses use their newsletter, their website, their Instagram feed, their blog posts to share what they've been up to. But I've seen very few businesses do this consistently in video format and the ones that do have had a lot of success. The team at Midday Squares have blown up doing this. Follow us to see us become one of the biggest chocolate companies ever or watch us crash and burn. Last year, we started sharing some general update videos about our company and some of the projects that we were working on and they drummed up some really great impressions for us. And I definitely think that they led to some new business because I've had several clients tell us that they found us directly through those videos. So they've been a hit and we're gonna continue to post them. You can make these videos scripted, structured and polished like some of ours, or they can be totally off the cuff and filmed on iPhone like this one. Number six is recruiting content. So in my regular conversations with other entrepreneurs, I hear time and time again that hiring and talent attraction is one of their biggest challenges. And that's only gonna be more difficult in a rocky economic climate like the one that we're in right now. So you may wanna consider taking your boring, run-of-the-mill text-based job posting and turning it into a video. Number seven is authentic content around diversity inclusion and community. If your organization is looking to demonstrate its commitment to diversity, inclusion, and community building, video can be a very powerful way to give voice to those who need to be heard. And there are a lot of different ways that you could go about this. In 2021, 22, we partnered with RBC and a team of advisors and filmmakers from the black community in Atlantic Canada to create a series of videos sharing the stories, challenges, and triumphs of a number of Atlantic Canada's emerging black leaders. In my opinion, this was a really cool and authentic way for RBC to support this community by telling real stories. Number eight, just a good old fashioned TV ad. I don't have cable or watch broadcast TV like at all, but my aunts and uncles, my parents, my grandparents do, and they all still buy shit. With the internet and social media constantly at our fingertips, it can be easy to cast stones at traditional TV advertising, but the truth is for certain demographics, primarily like the 55 plus, it's still highly effective. At the end of the day, there's no perfect formula for deciding exactly which type of video content you should be creating. But the fact of the matter is if you wanna grow 
and survive 2023, you've got to be creating video content. So start experimenting. These are just a few ideas to get you started. So good luck out there. Oh yeah. And uh, if you want to learn more about us and the videos that we make, maybe visit 365.ca or go on our Instagram or subscribe to our YouTube channel to see more videos like this. I don't know. I'm so tired. That's definitely not going to go in the video or maybe, maybe it will. Maybe it will. Maybe it's, maybe it's silly and fun. I don't know. Okay. I'm done.